the AWS Management Console shows an overview of AWS services. A scary number of services for different use cases. Where to start as a beginner? You will gain an overview of the AWS service portfolio during this module. AWS consists of different layers. Hardware for computing, storing and networking is the foundation of the AWS cloud. AWS runs software services on top of the hardware to provide the cloud. Virtual servers, app servers, enterprise applications, deployment services, storage solutions, database systems, networking infrastructure. A web interface and an API are acting as interface between AWS services and your applications. You can manage services by sending requests to the API manually via a web interface or programmatically via a SDK. The number of different services available can be scary at the outset. The following categorization of AWS services will help you to find your way through the jungle. Compute services offer computing power and memory. You can start virtual servers and use them to run your applications. Or you can run a small function in a predefined environment. App services offer solutions for common use cases, for example, sending emails, distributed message queues, transcoding media files. These services need to be integrated into your applications. Enterprise services are software as a service offerings for enterprise needs, for example, virtual desktops, email servers, or collaboration tools. Deployment and administration services work on top of the services mentioned so far, helping you to monitor your infrastructure, deploy your infrastructure and applications. Storage services help you to collect, persist and archive data. There are different storage options available. Network attached block storage for use with virtual servers, object storage or network file system service. The database services offer advantages over simple storage solutions when you need to manage structured data. AWS offers solutions for relational databases, NoSQL databases and in-memory databases. The networking services are an elementary part of AWS. They allow you to define private networks as well as using a well-integrated DNS service. You have learned about the most important services during this module. There are many more for specific use cases. Congratulations! You have reached the end of the first unit. Time for a short break to grab a coffee or tea. You will learn how to create an AWS account in the following unit.